It's called Job Court. A new program is looking to help keep people out of the criminal justice system and get them into good paying jobs. Job Court is a one year program with the hopes of changing lives for the better. But for it all to work, businesses have to get in on the plan. Jacqueline Francis live tonight for us. Jacqueline, tell us a little bit about how this works. Yeah, so let's say you commit a crime, a low-level, non-assaultive crime. You could be eligible for this program where instead of going to jail, you get a job. And a year later, if you're successful, those charges against you could be dropped for good. The most dangerous person out there is a person who has nothing to lose. And we want to give them something to lose. And that's a good-paying job with benefits. This is the idea behind Job Corp. Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel partnering with the Wayne County Prosecutor's Office in announcing the pilot program. In each case, a defendant is present who is willing to take accountability for their actions, demonstrates a strong likelihood for rehabilitation, and is tasked with meeting court-ordered requirements that they must fulfill. And in exchange, their charges will be dropped, and the defendants are very likely to avoid any incarceration at all. Those eligible for the program must be charged with qualifying, low-level, non-assaultive offenses and be recommended by the prosecutor. They'll then be matched with local employers, some of which have already pledged their support for the program. And there's interest on both sides. I've had defense attorneys stopping me in the hallway asking, how can my client participate in this great program? How can my client get access to these opportunities? The hope is to give people a chance before it's too late. Job Corps participants who successfully complete the one-year program will be provided with the opportunity to dismiss their eligible charges and hopefully be on a pathway to a better future. There are similar pilot programs going on in Genesee and Marquette counties. To start, they expect about 200 people to take part in Wayne County's program. Reporting live, Jacqueline Francis, Local 4. Cool. All right, Jacqueline.